<clears throat> we have a letter. Dear International Taste Station, I am a concerned mother on C Deck. Do people live in C Deck? I am looking for a fun, interesting juice box. People get drunk on C Deck. To send my kids to school off with. That that's weird syntax. Do you good. have any suggestions? Attached as a photo. Oh, to, uh, okay. Yes, we do. Did they write that in Invisible Ink? Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to International Taste Station. I'm Sir Molly Johnson. And I'm Patrick, Patrick O'Neill. And this week we're rising to a challenge in finding a different, fun, fresh, alternative thinking juice box. Or pack. I'm trying to avoid that slurp sound. Okay, this is weird. It's definitely creamy. And it's definitely peanut. But it's not like peanut butter. I really like peanut butter. This kind of makes me want to throw up though. Seriously, I love this. It's not even like a smoothie cuz like I'll add like powdered peanut butter to a smoothie. And this, this is, is like different still. Powdered peanut butter if you put way too much water and then put a shit ton of milk in it. What's wrong with that? Mm. You just twist it? Yep, yeah, just twist it up. And then <clears throat> Oh, there's nothing special. Nope. Okay. Mmm. It's very apple. It smells like my uh, those my, suckers. It smells like my dish soap. Potentially. Mm. It's like liquid apple candy. Yep, with jelly. Oh yeah, there's some jelly. I like jelly. Jelly is good. All right, so it's clear and, and obvious. It's the peanut punch. No way. It's the jelly apple. It's got the classic box. You get to shove a, 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 a straw into it, and you get that. How can you not love a drink with jelly in it? You get that slurp back. No way. It's Your this. drink. This is fun. It doesn't have sugar in it. Your drink wouldn't even let me drink it. You gotta smush it up a little bit. You it gotta work like, for it. It tastes like falling into a You're vat of syrup. You're burning calories trying to eat, drink this. Eat, drink, whatever. It, it was that sour. It was like biting straight into a, like it's a lemon sour without even peeling it. Maybe the first mouthful is sour. It was incredibly sour and incredibly Why don't you start sweet, the jelly which is surprising because somehow it's only seven calories for the whole pack. Maybe because they know no one finishes it. And there's like no sugar. Which is good. Which the is weird because... The peanut stuff was way too creamy and weird. I, I don't see anything labeled here as sugar. So somehow they didn't have sugar or, uh, or uh, sorry, sour. They didn't add any sour to it either. Best before date is MMDDYYYY. Classic Korea. Mm. Um... No, I, I can't get on board with that. It is no. very clearly this. The peanut butter stuff. This is a it's, juice box. It's just, it's too much. It's gross. It's rich. It's filling. It's a treat. It's rewarding. No. And it, I like it. It has butter. 8 grams of fat and 200 calories. Look, but beyond that. The winner is the apple. No, it's clearly this. This is the best I'm juice you box. Right now. That mother down on Sea Deck. I'm gonna see her later, and I'm telling her in person, it's the peanut punch. The one reason why this cannot be the winner is because you can't bring peanuts to school. Checking.
Well, that's all this week for International Taste Station. I hope you've learned something, but um, she says we're not allowed to teach. So until next time, I'm Sir Molly Johnson. And I'm Patrick, Patrick O'Neill. Bye. You know, a lot of people will go on like, Oh, when I was a kid, no one was allergic to peanuts. You wouldn't be allergic to peanuts when I was a kid. Or you would have been dead and said, Oh, we had peanut butter on our peanut, peanut butter on toast, peanut butter sandwiches, peanut butter on our crackers. We just eat peanut butter out of the jar. I put it to you that it's wrong. It's not that people weren't ah! allergic to peanut butter when we were kids. What it is, is no one cared that people were allergic to peanut butter when we were kids. Sorry, there's a hornet. My drink is preventing me from drinking my drink.